Hello, how's everybody doing today? I am so happy to see all of you and to be feeling well right now. It's been a journey since I've turned 33. You saw my last vlog, I dyed my hair blonde the week before my birthday and then I turned 33 on Saturday. I basically had to work all day on my birthday. It was like super busy at work. Got my ass kicked, basically didn't eat all day, didn't recommend Recommend. had some drinks at the end of the night. They hit me a little hard because I hadn't eaten all day and me and my friend were like kind of goofing around laughing. I was wearing my glasses and we hit our heads together and my glasses broke on the floor. Beautiful heart-shaped glasses. I have ordered another pair. No big deal. It was just an accident. It was really funny. I wake up the next day Sunday and I'm sick. I have like a fever. The next day started feeling worse. I was supposed to like go out Monday night, go out and see my family, see my twin brother and celebrate both of our birthdays. I called him and I was like, I just really do not feel good. He's like, hey, maybe you should take a COVID test. So I took one, came back positive. So I had to cancel all of the birthday stuff. Monday and Tuesday night, we were supposed to go out with families. That all got canceled. I got pretty sick Monday night, fever went up to 102. I felt like garbage. Almost thought I wasn't gonna make it for a while. I was in so much pain in my head. Took a few days off work, obviously didn't film and post a video last week. That's where I was. So we're redoing everything this week that we missed last week. And tonight I am going out with James, my boyfriend's family, to celebrate with them a week late because it was also his birthday that I was sick on. Thank goodness I'm feeling better. I am so grateful to be well again. I feel like as terrible as getting sick is, I feel like it can be a blessing if you look at it in the way of it making you just appreciate your life and being well so much more. Flower, you want to come say hi? Oh, there you are. Come here. Oh, my angel. This little angel stuck with me the whole time I was sick. She never left my side and you made mommy feel so much better. Love you. I am just kind of hanging out here today. I'm gonna take Flower on a walk in a little bit. Do you mind going down for a little bit? And then we'll go. Did you hear what I said? She knows what that means. I had so much fun with my family last night. It was so good to see them. It really made me appreciate being able to see your family like when I was sick and couldn't see them. That was really hard and it just makes you appreciate, you know? to show you some of my birthday cards. I don't know. I just thought the cards that I got this year were really special. This was the one from my mom and dad. I know my mom picked it out though, but it says, daughter, you're beautiful for so many reasons. See, why am I crying? I'm gonna cry again, you guys. Your strong spirit, your sweet smile, your loving heart, and your unique way of seeing the world. You make life more wonderful just by being you. Happy birthday, love you mom and dad just thought that was such a sweet card thank you i love it i love you mom and dad i don't know what i'd do without you guys and then how cute is this card from my brother and his fiance only gonna be a fiance for like two more weeks because they're getting married i'm so excited for this wedding it's coming up in like two weeks less than two weeks anyways how cute is this as you were born magical Happiest of births, Shannon. We love you to the moon and back. Love, Lil and Josh. I just feel like this is one of the cutest birthday cards I've ever seen. I love the pink mushrooms. Put those in here. I have this little like folder in my closet where I keep like memory papers and stuff. Oh my gosh, look at this. I love this little sticker. I need to find something to put this on. I forgot I had this. This is from an Etsy shop. Her name is Astral Weekend and she makes the coolest like stickers and artwork. Bought this because this just reminds me of 
of me because I grew up in Sugar Creek, which if you don't know what Sugar Creek is, it's like a quaint little like Swiss style village in Ohio. It's like a tourist attraction and they have the world's biggest cuckoo clock there. I will be going down there for, they have a Swiss festival every year. So maybe I'll film a vlog there. It's really cute. This just reminds me of me, like with like the psychedelic no mushrooms and everything, but like a cuckoo clock. This is fun going through memories. Oh my gosh, this was like the sweetest thing ever. Whenever James got me this for Mother's Day from Flower, it says, I'm your dog, wherever we go, whatever we do, you know that I'm happy just being with you. He put a little paw print. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't gotten one flower the last couple of years. I'm kind of confused. Oh my gosh, you guys, here's my collection I made in college. These were all of my models. I did children's wear and I designed and sewed all of these clothes myself. This was a, such a proud moment for me when I finished this collection. It's one of the hardest things I'd ever done in my life. I think we need this cloud skirt. I think we need this skirt to be made again. I feel like this is cute. Oh, here we go. Copy of my diploma, Kent State University, Bachelor of Arts, and I did graduate with honors, believe it or not. I do have a college degree. Put this away. Ah. <sighs> It's good to be well. So this right here, I was gonna film like a dedicated video for this, but I don't know. I think I just wanna open it now with you. A little more casual style and let's take a peek at this. This is the full collection from Sigma Beauty's Alice in Wonderland collab with Disney. This was kind of like my birthday present to myself. I bought the whole collection. Oh my gosh. If you know me, you know I'm a huge Alice and Wonderland fan. It's probably my favorite Disney movie. It really resonates with me. I love the Cheshire Cat. I love the Caterpillar. I love like the trippy mushrooms, like the trippy psychedelic aspect of the movie. This is so stinking pretty. Look at this brush set. It comes with five brushes. Sigma has really, really nice brushes. I love them. Happy birthday to me. You know what? Today is actually not my birthday. It is my unbirthday. So a very merry unbirthday to all of you, unless it's your birthday. This is so nice. We got this guy. It's kind of like a dense brush. I don't have any makeup on. And it has Alice on it. They all have different like characters on them. So heavy and nice. This is literally the softest thing. This one has the Cheshire Cat and it's kind of like an angled. I would say this would be like a nice blush brush. This feels like I'm living in the lap of luxury. It feels like the Cheshire Cat's tail is hitting my face. Okay, then we have like a really nice kind of like tapered eye blender. This one has like a little potion bottle on it. This one's more of like a little shader brush and this one has, what is it? Oh, I think that's supposed to be like the little like stopwatch that the white rabbit has. Oh my God, I like have chills. I love this, like a little detail brush. These are so nice, like a little pencil brush and then it has like the key on it. And then you guys, oh my gosh, look at this makeup bag. This is beautiful. Disney Alice in Wonderland. And then it says Sigma on the back. It's kind of like feels like rough, like the glitter. You can feel it. Which I don't mind. It's not shedding or anything. Oh my God. Can you see? How stinking beautiful. It's got like an Alice in Wonderland print in the inside. <gasps> Sigma, you killed it. Love the brush set. Put the brush set in the bag. Like how satisfying is that? Oh my gosh, even the little zipper has her like falling down the rabbit hole. These details are incredible. Let's open the palette. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to see. Would you just look at the beautifulness? I don't know, it's like so pretty, you guys. I don't know if I can even use it. Then look at the little insert. Oh, 
There's a brush in here as well. I'll take it out so it doesn't fall out. So you get a dual sided brush as well. So even if you don't buy the brush set, you still get a really cool brush with the palette if you did just want to get the palette. This color story is literally so gorgeous. I am obsessed and the little like stamp details they did, like there's like the white rabbit, Alice a tea party. It is literally Literally so pretty. Such good colors for fall too. Maybe we'll use it tonight when we go to dinner. This is the little like cheek duo. Tickled pink and paint the roses. So there's a blush and a highlighter in here. Has the same kind of like cover on it. Another insert, so cute. Let's just dust a little on because I don't have any makeup on. That's really pretty. Just kind of like a nice light highlighter. I really like that. Just put a little blush on. Just dry face, like blush on, whatever. Okay, love that duo. So you get two lippies. One is kind of like a really pretty like mauve pink. This one's called, this is the tulips. And on the top it has like the little pansy from that scene. Same on this one. This one's more of like a deeper, like sparkly purple. Singing violets. I want to try this one right now, the lighter. How fun is it to get new makeup and like play with it? I love it. Let's layer this one on top and see. I like that, just kind of like amped it up with like a little glitter. So I think I want to now go put some Halloween stuff out and I think that'll be fun if we decorate a little bit for Halloween together. Okay, you know what I just realized is that flower is actually going to kill me if I don't take her on a walk before I start decorating. Let's go take flower on a walk really quick and then we're gonna get spooky. Alright, back from the walk. I got really hot, so I took the overalls off. It's actually like pretty warm outside still. I feel like that happens a lot. It's like we feel like it's fall, but it's like still hot. Like what the hell is going on? Also wanted to just show you a couple things that I got. It is a felt rainbow Christmas tree. I found this at Home Goods. I'm obsessed. I need to find somewhere to put it though until Christmas because we are only decorating for Halloween right now. But isn't this like the cutest thing you've ever seen? It's kind of expensive. It was $80, but like, I feel like I needed it, you know? This is the other thing I got. Look at this beautiful floor pillow. It's a huge, this was only $45 and I feel like it's so pretty. Grabbed this guy and I'm putting it like over in front of the bookshelf right now and it looks really good. So other thing is I got new velvet curtains at Home Goods. They're like this really pretty like chartreuse color. And I feel like they've just made the room look so expensive and luxe compared to what it was before. I really, really like them. Before we just kind of had some like hand-me-down like whatever curtains, but they look really pretty. Yeah, so really excited about that. Oh. Got the fall Halloween bin. Love being organized. What is this? No idea when I bought these. Oh, I think I bought these at Dollar Tree. What I got these for, I don't know little felt stickers. I got these puffs new this year. I got these at Hobby Lobby. If you know me, you know I love puffs and <laughs> these are so cute. So I got these because I thought I have that vase up there. I'll just stick these in for fall time and see if it looks good. So this is like my seasonal arrangement, all seasons with the green. I'm just gonna stick this in. Does that look good? 
And simple as that, we have transformed it to the fall season. I think it looks good. Let me go finagle this. So, oh, these are the Halloween towels. We need to put those in the kitchen. We have two pink pumpkins. Ooh, we have the spooky gnome. I had a video last year where I decorated. So if you haven't seen that one, I have like a seasonal gnome I put out every year. So we're gonna take summer gnome down. The nice little pumpkin dish from the Salvation Army. Um, like tarot cards I wanna put out somewhere. These are cool. Cool. They're just like a version of the Smith Rider weight deck that I got at PJ Maxx of all places. <laughs> but I think I'll just put these out for like Halloween time. The spider tub with the pumpkin garland I cut apart. Someone that watched the video told me their kids were upset when I cut it. I'm sorry kids, but don't worry. So I got a new garland for this year. I tried not to buy too much new stuff this year. This was $15 at home. Home goods, the pumpkin jar, the fortune teller book. I bought a lot of this at Michael's last year. Like I said, I have a video on that. It's dusty. Okay, I'm gonna go up and start rearranging and we'll be back with the final result. We're getting rid of the summer gnome. He's gonna go into storage. wanted to show you this. This is a picture of my mom with me and my twin brother when we were babies. I look so much like my mom. It's like scary. And don't worry. I'll show you a close up of everything when it's done. I think I have the mantle looking good. I'll go ahead and show you everything. I wish I could get rid of the Xbox in the middle of the shelf, but as much as I've tried, it's not going anywhere. I am now going to work on assimilating all this new makeup into my drawer. Really happy with how the Halloween stuff came out though. I feel like I'm ready for spooky season now. So I put the brushes in this cup with like my Tinkerbell brushes. I feel like these are like my special Disney brushes now that I'm gonna keep up here. This cup was actually my grandma's and this was one of the only things I asked for when my grandparents passed away from the house. They asked me if I wanted anything and I said, I want that strawberry cup. All right, so we need to make room in here. Someone's gotta go, I don't know, I don't know. I think take Soft Glam 2 out of the drawer. Since I have the full size Soft Glam, I feel like I don't need both. And then let's put the Beauty in here next to my Sigma Enchanted. I have a couple like, up here that I'd like to get in the drawer now. If I get my setting sprays out of here, why do I have four setting sprays? No, I have five setting sprays. Lord have mercy. Oh, I don't hate that. So I got the two lip glosses. Here is the drawer. All right, I think I'm happy with that. I think that looks really good. I need to go eat lunch because I'm starving. I think I'm gonna keep these inserts and maybe like use them as bookmarks. I feel like these would be really cool bookmarks. Now I'm gonna go eat. <laughs> 
The neighbor's dog won't stop barking. I'm gonna lay down for a little bit and just rest. I have been moving all day and I'm just feeling a little tired. I think I'm gonna try to finish my book. If you're wondering what this is, this is Herbert. I've had him ever since I was little. He's like my BFF, he's my guy. But I think I'm going to just kind of lay down and try to finish the book I'm on. I'm on book, I think five of the Throne of Glass series and I feel like I only have like an hour left and it's getting really good. Chapter 69. <laughs> LOL. All right, let's get up. I was thinking about wearing this dress to dinner and I just tried it on. I realized there's a hole in it. I'm gonna sew it up really quick because I really want to wear this because I think it's gonna look really good with my new boots that James got me for my birthday. I can't wait to show you. Okay, so I just put this dress on. I got this at the thrift store and I've never worn it yet, so I thought I'd wear it. I just kept on my t-shirt that I've been wearing all day because I kind of thought it looked cute underneath and I'm just gonna keep my same jewelry on. But I need to show you guys my new boots that James got me for my birthday. Would you just look at these? I actually picked them out. He didn't pick them out, but they are so cute. They're like a hybrid between like a cowboy boot and like a Doc Martin. They are the Jeffrey Campbell Space Cowgirl boots and he got them from Free People. I think I'm gonna wear them for the first time tonight. They're gonna look so cute. I think I'm gonna try these socks with them. Okay, so now I'm just gonna do my makeup really quick and get ready to go. I'm so hungry. Wait, is that what really happened? Oh my god. All right, makeup is done. I'm ready to go out to eat with the family tonight and have a great time. I have to say I loved everything from the Alice in Wonderland Sigma collection. Blush and highlight was beautiful. I really like the eye look I came up with. I kind of went with more like the reds and oranges for like fall and to go with my red dress. I feel like a complete ass kicker in my new boots. I am gonna end the video here for today. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I had a lot of fun today just kind of doing enjoyable things for myself and getting to hang out with you guys. Subscribe to my channel before you leave if you wanna hang out again. And until next time, please remember that you are special, beautiful, and magical, and I love you so much. Bye.